lots of bags because the angels put them back to my channel. So today I'm going to be talking about where I've been, updates, what's been happening, what's happened, what's new, all that fun stuff. So I'm going to start off with where I've been. I've been so busy with school, um, that's going to be that way until I graduate. Uh, Bella that I had is a hamster, sadly passed away on February 9th, 2020, and it was not a fun day. Um, I was really crushed. I probably was still crushed for about over a week. I still just couldn't get over it. I did bury her in our yard and made like a homemade cross and I stuck it into the ground in a spot where nobody can get to her but I can get to her and see her and walk out there. I eventually knew that I wanted a new hamster because I miss Bella so so much. Um, I finally had enough money to get a new hamster so yesterday February 18th 2020 after after school I went and I bought a new hamster um, I just had to buy the hamster I didn't have to buy the cage or anything because I already had the cage bedding food like a Bella all the accessories and stuff like that so I went into PetSmart and I bought the hamster since I am over 18 I got to sign for it so I'm gonna pay for it for it this time and I got another Robo Dwarf because I already had the cage and I really wanted a Syrian but I thought you're gonna have to get a new cage, bigger water bottle, bigger food bowl, more accessories, bigger cage space. So I just decided no, I have enough stuff for the Robo so I'm just gonna get another Robo. And I did. So I adopted a Robo and I have my PetSmart paper here. And I signed for the hamster. I'm going to show you guys the new hamster. She just, I said the gender. <laughs> it's another girl. She just went down her tube. She is extremely active. She has a lighter face than Bella. And she's still pretty tiny because she is still a baby. She's not fully grown yet. But Robo Dwarfs aren't super big when they're fully grown either. I mean, they still look like a baby hamster. But she is just so little and she has the cutest face. And now she's gonna burrow under her bedding because she doesn't want to be seen. And then I will also be revealing her name. So first I'm gonna bring the cage down towards me and try to get her to come out to where you can see her. But I don't know. She might go back up her tube. But like I said, it is in the same cage that Bella was in. I'm actually going to take this tube off just for a brief second so that you guys can meet her. Okay. She's been running on her wheel like a crazy person. Where'd you go? Come here. She is way back there if you cannot see her. She's right there. There she is. So that is her. She looks very similar to Bella. It's just her face that's off. And then on her back, she kind of has some dark spots like Bella did, but not near as dark as Bella's. But Bella was one. She would have been two on February 15th. So she did pass before her birthday. I was very crushed by it. Um, I waited a week until I cleaned out her cage because I just couldn't deal with officially saying goodbye and then I got this new hamster so this is her she is so flipping cute I've had her for one day it's going on two days now I'll put your tube back on in a minute hold on she's super funny super active uh, she loves her wheel she really loves her tube I'm gonna have to get her more like tubes that I can make like longer extensions because she definitely loves that she loves to eat. I need to give her another scoop before I go to bed tonight. She loves hiding in her igloo. <laughs> and she loves running in her ball. Like I'll put her in her little ball and she runs like a crazy person on it. And she is just 
she's cute, she's funny, she's amazing, she's definitely filled the hole in my heart from losing Bella, and I can't imagine not ever having another hamster. Like, I couldn't imagine losing Bella and then just not getting another one, because they're just so funny and such fun little animals to have. <laughs> and they're cute how they burrow. I don't want to keep this video too long, so I am going to show you guys her name. Now, I did go through two names before officially deciding this name I actually had picked out for Bella as well, but I decided to name Bella Bella Grace. So, I named this one the other name that I was going to name Bella, but I didn't, and I love it. My mom doesn't like it. Dad didn't like it either, but I don't care. She's my hamster. I bought her. I love the name. So, her name is Bailey Page. And I loved this name for Bella, but when I held and saw Bella, I was like, no, you're a Bella for sure. So I just decided Bella Grace and Bailey Page was one of the options. So I named this one Bailey Page. I did go between Bailey Page or Tater Tot. Mom had to have both like Tater Tot better. I don't know. I just look at her and I don't see Tater Tot. I see Bailey Page. So... So that is my new hamster. I did lose Bella, unfortunately, but I do have a new one now. Super busy with college, so I won't be able to upload a lot. I'm gonna try to do some uploads. Um, I don't really know how often I'm gonna be able to because it does, I mean, most of my nights are consistent with doing homework online, reading, studying for exams, all that crazy stuff but I wanted to hop on um, give you guys an update let you guys know I'm still alive and that I may have lost a hamster but I gained one as well so with that being said we love you all so much and don't forget to subscribe if you are new and you will also become a part of Ashley's Angels once again we love you all so much and we will see you guys in our next video bye